We are using the KUKA LBR Med to provide a rehabilitation tool to physiotherapists. What they can do with this is mobilization therapy. So if we look, for example, at uh, stroke patients, they need to repeat simple motions many, many times to learn basic tasks again. What we are now able to do is to automate this mobilization process. What the sensorized cuff allows us to do is to add some extra safety to the platform and to encourage participation from the patient. The controller is the part of software that is responsible for decision making. This decision making is based on AI. So AI uses inputs, data streams, to create a specific output. This specific output is what the controller uses to then generate a specific motion. This can be providing more resistance, less resistance. The main benefits for the patients are that we can capture their intention, their state, and as a result, uh, yeah, create a more personalized treatment for them. And also because of the internal pressure sensors also give a more safe treatment. And with the KUKA uh, LBR Med, we have a, a robot arm that can do a, a whole range of exercises with uh, high frequency, high intensity, and as a result, yeah, increase the performance of the patient after the rehabilitation. Next phase for us is real-world testing. Bring the device inside the hospital, have it treat patients, have the medical staff work with it, iteratively improve the device, go through clinical validation, go through certification to end up with product development. Industrial Intelligence.